What's up? I'm Troubleshoot. In this quick guide, I'll be showing you how you can install Docker on Arch Linux. The process is actually super simple. The first step is preparing your system for Docker, and we need to install one prerequisite, that being the GNOME terminal. Open up a new console or terminal, type sudo pacman s gnome hyphen terminal and hit enter, followed by your password to install the gnome terminal. Even if you're not going to be using this, this is required for Docker to work properly. Then we'll need to install Docker to get access to Docker, Docker Compose, etc. I'll use sudo pacman s docker to download this as well. This will set up Docker on our system. Then in order to actually use it, we'll need to enable it. So sudo systemctl enable hyphen hyphen now docker.service and we'll be running the same command this time with start instead just to make sure that it's running and now we can use sudo docker to get some info about it and sudo docker info to see if it's running properly. At this stage, it should be. However, to interact with Docker, we still need to use sudo at this point. In order to allow your user to use it, run sudo user mod hyphen a hyphen capital G docker followed by your username. When you do so, you'll add the Docker group to your account. Then all you need to do is su followed by your username to re-log into your account in your terminal. And now you should be able to run Docker info without the need of typing sudo before it. We can also use Docker run followed by the example getting started that should download and set it up, then we should be able to navigate to localhost and we'll see localhost tutorial. This is the getting started tutorial here. Super simple. Now, if you'd like some extra control and ease of use, if you're not too comfortable using the command line, we can install Docker Desktop super easily. In order to download Docker Desktop, head across to the link you'll find in the description down below, where it gives you install instructions for Debian, Fedora, Ubuntu, and Arch. Unfortunately, Arch is still experimental at this point. What you need to do is click this big button at the very top to download the latest version of Docker desktop. We'll wait for this download to complete, then we'll navigate into our downloads folder. Now once your download is complete, navigate to your downloads either using your file browser, then right click and choose open terminal here, otherwise we can just use cd tilde slash downloads and we'll get to the same place. In here we have our docker desktop installer. Simply run sudo pacman hyphen capital U, hit tab to type in the file in this folder and hit enter, followed by your username, typing it correctly that is, and there we go. We'll confirm yes and it'll start setting up Docker Desktop on your system. If you're asked anything about installing QEMU, you can choose the lightest version, which is usually number one, but if you plan on using QEMU for desktop virtualization and things like that, and you don't already have it installed, you should choose QEMU full, which is usually the third option. Option. Now at this point we can open up Docker Desktop from our start menu or quick start and in here you can see our getting started container in the containers section that we can then delete and or remove. The first time you start up Docker Desktop you'll be asked if you want to log in. You can choose to log in otherwise you can skip it using the button at the very bottom and log in later using the sign in button up here if you ever need access to private Docker repos. Anyways that's really about it. You now have Docker running on your system now you can use it in your terminal Docker Desktop VS Code etc. Hopefully you found this video useful thank you for watching my name's been Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!